A new exhibition in Seoul is filled with eye-catching pieces and bright bursts of color. But a second look reveals this exhibition is a sharp critique of today's political and pop culture. I use global media as my source, as well as popular culture, and try to collage them. Controversial political issues transform into pop art for polypop a new exhibition from new media artist Mina Chun. She has always found inspiration in the complicated social issues of today's world, spinning them into works of art in her unique signature style. Even the name of the exhibition, Polypop, is unique and unfamiliar to most people. There have been political pop art in art and art history, um, I created the term polypop, which sounds like lollipop, and um, it takes political concerns um, and turns them into pop artworks. At the exhibition, visitors can meet former North Korean leader Kim Jong-il, transformed into a Pokemon character. The exhibition is divided into red and blue rooms. The color contrast symbolizes the polarization of Korea's foreign relations, as well as the conflict between the cultures of Asia and the West. You could see images that are found that reflect conflict between North, not only North and South Korea, but also um, within Korea and Japan, and the imagery of uh, China becoming a capital nation. Mina Chen combines videos that she filmed herself at the Dokdo Islands to create an installation piece that trains the spotlight on the international controversy over the Korean islets. Within the video installation pieces, you could see uh, not only traveling to Dokdo physically, but also virtually. It's a kind of recollaging of those video footages uh, from the internet as well, um, of myself as an avatar uh, traveling in Second Life Dokdo. Polypop does not limit itself to issues related to Korea. One part of the exhibition features all of the major world events that happened over the course of 2011. It took me a year to make it. It took me every day to make it. And I would be able to select one image a day, which I felt was the most sensational image of that day that ranged from politics to pop culture. Politics meets pop art in polypop. Treat yourself this month to a wacky yet meaningful exhibition that will have you looking back on 2011 in a whole new way.